Let's talk about how to customize Logic's Arrange window. The first and most obvious customization is this Inspector button in the top left hand corner of the screen, which enables you to hide or show the inspector. This can be useful when you need a bit more space on the screen. You've also got these preset tools that run along the top of the screen where I'm moving the mouse now. And you can have any tools or any combination of tools you like available to you there. So if you right click in the space, you can see you've got an options in the list, which are icon only, text only, or icon and text, which is how it comes as default. So icon only, text only, or icon and text. Now you can actually choose which of these tools is available to you. Again, right clicking or control clicking in the space and go to customize toolbar. Once you've got customized toolbar open, you can see again you've got a bunch of preset options here. So, for example, if you were to regularly use Move to Track, you can pick it up, drag it to the top, wait till the green plus sign appears, then let go, and you've now got that tool permanently available to you at the top of the screen. If you decide you don't want that, you can drag it away and it disappears. So, let's add a couple that we, I use fairly regularly here. Uh, the first of which I'm looking for is Strip Silence which is there, and drag it to the top. And then if you look at previous marker and next marker. If there's any tools that come in the preset list that you don't use on a regular basis, insert section in my case, you can drag it away and it disappears. If you don't like what you've done in terms of modification, you can drag the default toolbar back into the top bar and you're back where you started and click done. Same applies down here to the transport bar as well. So if you right click it, customize toolbar and then you've got a huge long list of modifications you can make to the standard transport in our case let's add capture recording okay and we've got our capture recording button added down the bottom here again if you don't like what you've done go back and right click or control click in the space customize transport bar and you've got the restore to defaults button You can also separate the toolbar from Logic's Arrange window so you can have it as a float window. You do this by going to View, Transport, switch it off and it's disappeared. If you now go to Windows and select the Transport, which is Apple 7, you can bring it up and then you've got a Transport bar. You can drag anywhere you like in the Arrange window. And that is how you customise Logic's Arrange window.